Welcome back to Evil Deeds, and we are playing on the iOS uh, choices with the fantasy story with the uh, Red Eagle Clan. So, chapter 5 the challenge. Now, playing as Kenna, you now stand in the center of the camp filled with mercenaries. A former Stormholt soldier in front of you is Leo, the former guard, captain of Stormholt, and Serene, the leader of the mercenaries. Everyone take a good look. For the first time, we've got royalty in our camp. Too bad it's just to we turn a, turn a in for Prince. Marco's reward. It's true, I'm Queen Kenna, Rays of Stormholt, and I intend to take back the Five Kingdoms. The people in the corridor all start mumbling. mumbling. Oh, yeah. You're the one pe the you're the one pe people are talking about. And I meant to say yeah, you're the one person are talking about. Uh, the last queen who's gathering an army. It's really it, the legend's true. I say we let them be on their way. We don't need to turn it over to Marco. How, we've got the queen here, and you're just going to let her walk away? The bounty pr prince Marco put on her head is 3,000 gold coins. The mercenaries cheer. We'll eat for months after that. Turn her over and Marco will have her red. So, who's she to us? The mercenaries begin to cheer. There's another way. You could join me, all of you. We'll retake this land and restore our kingdom to glory. Glory? You mean your glory? You want to be some queen in a castle sitting on a throne of pillars? Right. While real men like we do the daily work, a real leader fights his own fights. Everyone else is just a weakling waiting until someone stronger pushes them. Your mother learned that the hard way, didn't she? You have reason for that? You do not have enough stats to pick this option. <laughs> I'm not my mother, I won't make any mistakes. Give me a ch chance to prove myself. Funny thing about chances, you can't eat them. And my men need to eat. Serena, I can't let you hand her over. Don't be a fool. You can't see if you want to join her cause. I don't. We can release her and Gabriel. There's no reason to have their blood on their hands. I can think of about 3,000 reasons who's with me. I am. The mercenaries cheer. Some of the former Stormholt soldiers join in, but others look conflicted. Besides, it's my car. The strong lead. The weak bleed. And I'm the strongest one here. Get over here, Queen Kenna. You're coming with me. So if the strongest lead, then I'm going to have to beat him then. Serene reaches for you, but Gabriel stop, steps in. I challenge you, Savior. Huh? As you said, strength leads, among, leads amongst your people. If you're the strongest one here, prove it to fight me. What? So this is where Gabriel's going to die. So now playing as Dominic in the kitchen. In the kitchens you find rose baking bread for nights to Have you learned anything about our friend in the dungeon? Oh Dominic, it's so sad. He's bleeding from a dozen wounds and can barely move his arms. They must have broken him. Broken it. He needs real food to recover, but they only let me bring him scraps. 
They don't care if he recovers. You heard Marco in the courtyard. They mean to kill him. It's only a question of when. The guards told me I'd be bringing him food until the end of the week. Then we have to act before then. With any luck, I'll, I'll save our friend before he's tortured into giving up any information about Kenneth. The princess, you were in love with her aunt, wasn't you? Nope. I was, I love her till the day we were just friends. Real? We were close as ch children, but that's it. I just thought the way you care so much about her. She's the rightful queen, I want to see her back to the throne. As do I, how can I help? You do enough, leave the rest to me. Pardon me, we're in this together. It's one thing for me to risk my own life, but I don't want to see you in danger. Every day we live here, we're in danger. Last week Marco had a servant flogged, flogged to death for spilling wine on his tunic. Going back to Link's timeline. Fair enough, but Rose, you're always being cautious. I couldn't live with myself if you got into trouble because of me. Oh, well. Rose blushes. Being near you makes me brave. Rose. I'll follow you anyway, don't I? So, what's your plan? If you're bring, bringing the prisoner his food, then we can use that. Maybe today I can go with you. It's a plan then. You and Gabriel have been placed in Leon's tent and put under guard whilst the mercenaries go for the door. At least they had the decency to retain my sword to me. Gabriel twirls his sword and practices a strike while you watch, frowning. It was a cunning move. I wasn't entirely sure it would work. You challenged him publicly. His blood was blinded. So it just seemed like their blood first sort. But he's still a mercenary first and foremost. He's not the type to fight only for the sake of spilling blood. No, he accepted my challenge because refusing would make him look weak to his own people. And the mercenaries would turn on him. Precisely. Gabriel practices at a lunch. But Gabriel, I wish you wasn't doing this. Funny, I thought I was supposed to be your bodyguard. Just because you, you, you've you spent your life worrying about me doesn't mean I can't worry about you too. My queen, this duel is the only answer to our predicament, or whatever, predicament. I'm just not sure this is a good idea. There's still enough fighting me to defend you. I knew I knew you would die to protect me, Gabriel. It's the dying part that I'd rather avoid. You've been like a father for as long as I can remember. You've always been there for me. And it was my pleasure always. You've grown so quickly. Do you remember when you were just a girl? The boy your mother held in your honour when I found you in tears. So this is going to be like some kind of diamonds to recap the memory of some of that. Is this really the time to change, dodge up that embarrassing memory? You learned a valuable lesson that day, or do you not remember? See what I mean? See, uh, want to see what Kenna was like as a little girl? This is your chance. Unlocking memories will give you exclusive scenes. You'll get the chance to earn more prestige points and increase your army score for the final battle. And remember to keep building your army score for the final battle. Even one point can make a huge difference. Ooh, got one diamond left. Uh, diamond left. So, can't do it.
it's not time for that. Similarly, we'll have to wait. We must come up with another plan. We have a plan. I will fight for you as I have always done. Please don't go through with this. There must be another way. I wish you were right, but these men will only respect and show of strength. They strongly the weak lead. You're right, the strong lead. Now playing as Dominic. You, Rose, and Tyson are preparing a meal to bring down to the captive monk. I'll take the food down to it. Not long you went. I'll come with you. Me too. We'll all need something to carry. Lucky for you too. I also bring the guards their dinner. So there's plenty to go around. Here Tyson take this picture of what. Dom take these plates. Carrying the night's meal. The three of you head to the dungeon. About time we got our food wench. Here you go, sir, and may I fill your glass? As Ross touched the guard, you and Tyson set down the plates and quickly slip into the shadows. And for dinner, I've made you the finest roasted to quarrel. Whilst the guards eat their food, you sneak down the stairs to find the monk, sir. That's in the next picture. You approach one of the cells in the back. Sir, are you all in there? Y yes. The monk slowly pulls himself over to the bars. Here, you take this food. What news have you, my friend? Did my hawk reach you in time? You're the one who sent the warning? Then you did get it in time. Yes, the Queen lives, or at least she was alive. When last I saw her, she fled with her guard. Gabriel saw the old man is still kicking. He remains, he remains a dedicated protector to Kenna. I haven't seen Kenna in two years. Tell me, is she happy? Is she safe? Did she even speak to me? Happiness was not part of her training. It had no bearing on her ability to rule or survive. But I believe she was not unhappy. Can I? There's no time for this, Tom. You're right, we've got to get you out of here. My execution has been ordered for tomorrow. Prince Marco will have my head before sunset. Tomorrow, but I heard that it would be at the end of the week. Apparently, any information I have is no longer needed. They've stopped questioning me. What? I believe this means Prince Marco has uncovered something about where Queen Kenna has, is now. I wish I knew more. This isn't good. We've got to figure out what Marco knows. But first, we're breaking you out of here. We're not letting them kill you. Don't concern yourselves with me. I've accepted my fate. Well, we haven't. Well, we'll we'll be back soon. Be prepared to flee. You lean forward to grasp the monk's hand, and he stares at the flame-shaped marking on your chest. <coughs> that brand. I didn't know you were. From the mountain tribe. If I am, no one bothered bother to tell me. Then you have no idea what the mark means. Something to do with fire, something to do with mountains. Obviously, something to do with fire. Some strange things have been happening to me. The monk st st stares into your eyes. Have you felt it, the fire? How did you? Just then you hear the clanking sound of the gate opening. Bartol and Helen are coming. If they spot us, they'll recognize us and know we're up to something.
Then we just have to make sure they don't see us. You hid in a cell next to the monks, pulling Tarzan in with you. I don't see why we can't do it now. I brought my new set of pokers and everything. Prince Marco wants a public execution. You can't round up all the rambles in a couple of hours. Notice how notice have been sent on notice. You hear the sound of footsteps stop. Should we go now? Run for it, wait. No we wait. They're not at the cell yet, or we would have heard him talking to the monk. You wait for a moment, the sound of footsteps resumes. Here he is. Indeed, there's our prisoner. Are you satisfied, Elena? You can't be too careful. I've never fully trusted the castle staff. I believe some may still be loyal to the fuel queen. Yeah, I guess we could have killed them all. If you want to make your own food and empty your own chamber pot. On your feet, prisoner. If you don't know what a chamber pot is, it's a pretty much a toilet. Which you have to empty outside. And then put it back in. It's like a bucket for your waste. T Tyson looks like you, I'm sure. Now. Now. You and Tyson sneak past the cell where Elena and Bartle are speaking to the monk. You should have saved yourself when you had the chance now Prince Marco has no need of you. I will never betray my queen. Insolent wench. Bartle kicks him. The monk lets out a groan and you feel anger growing inside you. So we got a controller, obviously. Up ahead you see Rose waiting by the gate, gesturing quickly for you to come. How to, do you react? Lose focus, get distracted, becomes confused, focus your power. So, so, see, that's what I mean, it needs a quick time event, it needs like a timer or something. Anger flashes through you, your hands feel hot. What? You shake off the strange sensation and continue, continue away from the sun. The sounds of Bartle beating the monk echoes down the hall. Suddenly, Tyson nudges you sharply and he gets it on fire. Tyson places a finger over his lips and points behind you at a guard standing just a few feet from you. Oh gods, I've got to find a way past that guard. I should sneak past the guard, grab the guard sword. You step behind the guard making as little noise as possible. Hate this creepy dungeon. You get past the guards, Cecilia, and motion for Tyson to follow your lead. Just as Tyson is about to step forward, the guard turns and spots Tyson standing right behind him. Who are you, and what are you doing in the dungeon? Uh, uh, that is to say, let Tyson hand it, got the guard sword. Before Tyson can get away with it, in the edgeways, you snatch the guard sword from his shaft. Or shaft. The guard immediately spins around. What in the? Stab the guard, threaten the guard with the sword. Stab the guard. You panic suddenly. The sword feels heavy in your hands. Well, that's disappointing. I was looking forward to a fight. The guard grabs Tyson by the throat and squeezes. You watch as Tyson. Tries and claws at the guard, his face turning from blue to purple, finally to paper white. The ground kicks Tries and Buddy out of the way as he takes a step forward, a uh, step towards you. He rips the sword from your hands. What's this game on about? At, at the very start of the game, he, he defended himself against the queen, and she's meant to be a, a good. A uh, swords person. Night, nighty night. Now, 
The gun makes one quick precise slash your head slides from your shoulder and lands on your, your own feet, leaving you to stare up at your own discapitated body. You are, you have died. What do you do? For a chance you can get away, the guard immediately spins around. What in there? Stab the guard, threaten the guard with his, with the sword. You point the business end, the business end of the sword of the guard's chest. Now here's what's going to happen. You're going to let us walk out of here and you're going to pretend you never saw us. Or what? You'll stick me with my own sword? Yes. Do it then. Go on, stab me. What? I say stab me. The guard grabs you by the throat with a good clad hand and squeezes. Oh. Some professional advice. If you're going to threaten someone, you have to have the stones to follow through like this. The guard rips the sword from your hand and plunges it into your chest. Your eyes widen as the guard pulls the sword free and with a fob you collapse to the floor. So what's the point in this checkpoint if we can't really do anything? So that means I'm going to have to restart the checkpoint. Alright, there's other time. You apparently saw that the sword feels heavy in your hands. So he's got stabbed. This checkpoint is stabbed. Oh. Well, that's just the help service shit. There is not a witch choices. Mm. I'll go back to the menu. Zoom high checkpoint what can't get past. Shit. I do restart then. Chapter 5 out of 8. Do 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 Don't want to resume. Hey, Ben. So we can't carry on that story then. Let the chip points put chip points down. Oh, 
there's a lot of books. You will complete this chapter to restart the book to revisit past choices and change the story. So you gotta restart from the very beginning of the book. Nice. You complete this chapter to restart the book. Nice. I don't know what to do. So Hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, subscribe, or comment down below if you want to. But you don't have to. It looks like I can't go anywhere in that story. So just pick one random out of this if you want. So we've got the Bloodbound, uh, the Royal Romance Book 3, I guess. So book 1, High School Story Book 3, Endless Summer Book 3, Perfect Match. The Freshman Book, The Royal Romance Book 1. So there's three books of that. Perfect Match again. Rose of Engagement Book 1. Uh, high School uh, Book 1. Love Hawk Hacks Book 1. Home for the Holidays. Uh, Red Carpet Diaries. My dearies. Bloodbound. Freshman, Royal Romance, High School, High School, Rules of Engagement, Rules of Engagement, Rules, No the Wets, uh, Love Hacks, Freshman, 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 The Sopomore Book, uh, Sopomore Book 2, The Junior Book 1. So every week it says it gets added or updated or whatever. So in a bit. Bada boom.